Hey Gunner, thanks for the resub. It's alright. It's not amazing, it's not bad. It's still stupid arrow. <laughs> like, that's even stupider. Canonically, he says it because of severe brain damage. That's like legitimately even worse. I'd rather it just be like part of its goof instead of trying to weave it in narratively. That actually just makes it worse. So he has severe brain damage, thus always shouts crispy critters. <laughs> Good lord. Come on. I don't need to upgrade. Not that hooker bot again. Watch out. There are robots beneath us. Really? I thought they were ladybugs. I think there's a bald one. What a piece of shit. Wow. A drop kick that oh, close, huh? Fucking tin man. And here's Lenin. Just like at the VDNH in Moscow. Indeed. But locked. What else is new? Charles, open it. Unfortunately, I yep, lack I saw the attack on Titan trailer. Unlock doors. You're like a broken record, you know that? I'll deal with it. like dying light uh not super similar i'll just park this here there's a couple commonalities but it's not like a carbon copy of dying lights melee or anything like that this room contains the hawk but the security system locked the door when the emergency protocol was active. Is he still alive? I thought that kill. Jesus Christ, this guy's fucking me up. Got a lot of bad boys here. Can you come up, please? Thank you. Got a few, few bad boys out here. Hey Charles, how can shock can go through polymer but not through regular water? Is all the water here distilled or something? Your knowledge of physics is rather impressive, Connor. You could be right, but no, the water here. <sighs> Generates isolated electricity that only functions in a cloud of dispersed volume. Okay, so it only works no. with less dense substances, like other polymers or other electrical fields. The same goes for the gloves' other abilities. Frostbite. It's probably example. not even so worth to keep this run like going. Water. May Tesla bless you, Major. Do I have to kill them to open this or something? Oh, I'm dead. Thanks for your super mixel. Some headman. Oh my god. That's a long run back. I shouldn't have bothered doing that. 
Exit Prime 2. Not really, Tadoya. Locked. What else is new? Charles, open it. Unfortunately, I lack the ability to unlock doors. You're like a broken record, you know that? I'll deal with it. Please? Thank you. Well, that didn't work out in my favor. This room contains the hot turtle, but the security system locked the door when the emergency protocol was activated, preventing unauthorized access. So how do I open that then? Hey Charles, how come shock can go through polymer but not through regular water? Is all the water here distilled or something? Your knowledge of physics is rather impressive, Comrade. You could be right, but no, the water here is quite ordinary. Shock generates isolated electricity that only functions have to go to the within tower. a cloud of dispersed bulk. Usually okay. they mark that, so or at least they did the last time. Less dense substances, like other polymers or other electrical fields the same goes for the gloves other abilities frostbite for example so it's like oil and water may tesla bless you major no 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 no, no. get in Enemy is on high alert. Thanks, Yusuf Sean. Where is he going? What, do I not go Someone said I have to go to the tower to open that, right? Which is one of those towers that uh, lets me do the cameras, isn't it? What? what Chat was the one saying that. That's what the tower was for. It's marked for you. What? No, it's not. This is where I'm supposed to go. Oh, I'm so fucked. But I can't open it. Oh. There's one right there. But yeah, I can't open that. That's not what's marked. I just didn't know there was a close one. Here. Oh, no, 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 no. Are you planning to disable the Hawk? It isn't responsible for opening the VVNH's doors, you know. Uh, w well, I gotta do something, okay? I'll start with the Hawk. Where's that guy going? Thanks the resub, Jake. In the resub Haven, in the tier one Wardy, in the resub Dorito. Cut. Hmm. 
It's the Hawk's service button. What does it do? It will cause the Hawk to land, so it can be serviced by a technician. How long will it stay there for? If it fails to make contact with a technician, it will not long. Then Whoa, this is a fucking shame. I'm gonna take a ride on the Hawk and get a better view of the place. Maybe I'll see some. Jesus. What should I do? Hang on to this handle or something? Hold on tight. Hawks are not designed to be ripped. What are these cables for? They weren't here before. The cables stabilize the Hawk during bad weather. Ah, oh, maybe I can slide down a cable. Shit, would you look at that? It's that thing again. Be careful. Hawk 7 units are quite dangerous. Oh, come on. It's freaking adorable. Okay. Thank you for having yourself, Wardy. Appreciate it, man. Show me your fucking weak point again. There we go. Wow. Holy. Of healing. Next to the resub, Sean in Vault. I don't need to upgrade. I'll be fine. What are these cables for? They weren't here before. The cables stabilize the Hawk during bad weather. Ah, huh. maybe I can slide down a cable. Assuming this is gonna like block the rolling or something. This I don't know how I'm supposed to avoid. That sucks super hard. I can't use these too close. 
This piece of shit. Ugh. Okay. What the fuck? I can't use it when he's too close, and he just gets right up in my shit instead of waiting for- or doing it from a distance. God damn. Oh, let me grab something from here. Access granted. What are these cables for? They weren't here before. Should be all I need. Fading data. <coughs> nah, I don't need to upgrade anything yet. I'll be fine. Shit, would you look at that? It's that thing again. Be careful. Hog 7 units are quite dangerous. Oh, come on. It's freaking adorable. Good use of savage. I don't know how to avoid that, it just it sucks too hard. No matter what I do, I don't make it. Let me reset the Nero. Yeah, maybe I do need to upgrade character to avoid that, like increased movement speed or something. Man, this guy is just refusing to roll at me now. Wow, he's really coming at me. He's still coming. You tell me, Major. You have far more experience with combat robots than I do. I, I do? I mean, shit, I do, but I can't remember a damn thing. They seem different somehow.
Mick Gordon is going kind of hard. Access granted. Now I'll upgrade. Let's just do, well this one would be pretty cool, let's do that and then down here maybe, nah, let's just do all these, I can afford them all. I haven't done any energy management stuff, but that's fine. Oh Please wait, I want to upgrade this. Procedure. Anything for this? Eh, nothing super useful here. I'll just keep stockpiling those for a bit. Man, I can really see the difference in that running speed. Disassemble your old melee weapon. Oh. Yeah, I forgot to do that. Whatever. Pretty impressive, isn't it? You can really tell we're on the threshold of something really incredible. I just wish there weren't bodies all over the damn place. The celebration will be held on Monday in honor of national polymerization and the launch of the All the highest ranking members of the Communist Party will be here. I can fix all this by then. I certainly hope your optimism turns out to be justified. It will, you'll see. I won't let Dr. Section off down again. More locked doors. What? Who the There's hell keeps puzzle? locking everything? Whoever he is, I bet he's got a goddamn combination lock on the John at home. These doors will be open via a symbolic gesture during the ceremony. Symbolic how? The system of mirrors will focus beams of light on the model of our solar system hanging above the entrance. I'll see what I can do. Great. The mirror on the right is all set. Uh, the mirror on the left isn't working. Something is jamming the mechanism and preventing the mirror from ascending. Got it. Looks like it's back to the basement for me. No entry. And a skull and crossbones. That's encouraging. Where am I? The magnetic shock absorption system is located on this basement level. All the rooms here are full of mobile electromagnetic clusters. I can use an EMP on them. Um, it's not gonna kill me, is it? Let's hope not, Comrade Major. What? So I could get crushed by a falling wall of magnets? Theoretically speaking, that shouldn't happen, but this is merely a hypothesis. I've never been here before. Seriously? That's weird. Well, whatever. I don't need any of that. Oh, you can only use that on those, I see. Those freaks and their goddamn mustaches again. Oh my god. What you staring at, you metal dipshit? 
How long is it? Apparently like 20 hours. Yikes. the point of this fucking maze anyway? The magnetic shock absorption system was developed by scientists from Kiev Polytechnic University. It's a very complex and comprehensive device that alters its configuration according to the situation. So it's plan B in case of a natural disaster. Among other things, but it is first and foremost a trial run of the magnetic shock absorption system. Here, under Earth conditions, the system will be perfected so that it can be deployed in space. Cool. Science is power. There's no denying it. But we still need to find a way past all these goddamn magnets. I feel like I can just make this straight up. Another yeah. door without a oh. lock. Ugh. Where's the relay, Charles? I don't see anything on the walls. No good materials. I'm guessing it's gotta be over there then. What am I looking for? I don't even remember. It said another door without a relay. The fuck does that even mean? What relay? Usually it's just like right nearby. I already went there. In there. Charles. What the hell does Molotov have okay. against Dr. Sechenov? Why do you have to cook this commission up two days before the launch of Collective? Everything's ready. Exactly because everything is ready. What do you mean? Are you trying to say that Molotov and his commission want to steal the fruits of Sechenov's labor two days before the launch? Indeed. The malfunction Petrov caused is an excellent pretext for showing that Dr. Sechenov is incapable of overseeing Facility 3826, and by extension, the polymerization of the Soviet Union. What's the boss got to do with it? This is all Petrov's fault. He's the one who made the robots turn the facility into a heap of corpses. I'm afraid Comrade Molotov doesn't care how many victims there are, but neither does Comrade Sechenov. What? What the fuck are you talking about, Glove? The boss is doing everything he can to fix this. To be precise, Comrade Major, it's you doing everything you can to fix this, not Dr. Sechenov. But he's the one who sent me here. But why did he do that? <laughs> Think about it logically. Comrade Sechenov and Molotov both have something to gain from preventing information about this terrible malfunction becoming known to the rest of the world. Because no one would believe that a handful of traitors are responsible for the whole thing. Everybody would think that Soviet robots are dangerous. Quite right. But so this one doesn't move no matter what I do. Draw from this? Only that hypothetically, oh, well, no, Comrade Sechenov and Molotov should both have a vested interest in ending this nightmare as quickly as possible. Isn't that right? Yeah. So what? We're seeing a common, everyday power struggle. Instead of going to the government and having troops sent to Facility 3826 
to destroy the hostile robots, arrest Petrov, or end this in some other way, Dr. Sechenov is doing everything he can to conceal the tragedy from everyone, including the government. Man, Glove is really dumping some heavy shit right now. They can't send in the army. There are too many people. Somebody could leak intel to the enemy and then it's all over. But only reliable men could be sent to the facility, such as the Argentum unit loyal to Sechenov. They could team up with combat robots and restore order in the blink of an eye. But I don't need to tell you about that, do I? But that's, I mean, ugh, crispy critters. I don't get it. Why does it have to be so complicated? Because Dr. Sechenov can't deploy troops or combat robots without the authorization of the Politburo. On the contrary, he's doing everything he can to make sure the government doesn't know what happened. Why do you think that is? Because his enemies would take collective away from him? Now, when everything's built and ready to go, and any asshole with a badge could run it. Quite right. It's all done. Just fix the malfunction and press a button. Geniuses, creators, and engineers have already done their jobs. All that's left to do is enjoy the fruits of their labor. God, he's still words, going. Karma Holy fuck, he is really dumping all of it. Holy shit. Happened here so he can take over the facility himself? To be exact, he wants to This leave leaves nothing to the imagination. How can he? Everybody's going to be equal there. Some will be more equal than others. My God. Well, no. All right. I know that high-ranking Communist Party members will have more authority and collective than ordinary citizens, but that's fine. I mean, somebody's got to make big decisions, right? Is that so? Why, pray tell? Well, first off, somebody has to be responsible for carrying them out. Damn, it's not like God. everyone can be responsible for everything. Everyone means no one. Someone's got to take responsibility. The buck has to stop somewhere, right? And if the whole world did nothing but debate big decisions, no one would ever do anything. They'd spend all their time talking. Oh, but what if you're wrong? You say that the entire world would never stop discussing important decisions. Collective Still going. Fuck. Mind. Oh, my God. Having merged into one, mankind will instantly know everything anyone wants to express. And in this singular collective, Ooh. responsibility will be determined not by fear of punishment, but by awareness. Has anyone ever reached that level, even here in the USSR? We're not perfect to say nothing of the rest of the world. Absolutely right. The world may not be ready for the launch of collective. The Soviet Union's leaders understand this. That's why the party will have special discretionary authority within collective. What's wrong with that? That's how it's always been. Has it really? Or has there always been one indisputable leader, a puppet master controlling the Politburo, the Council of Ministers, and all the rest? Are you trying to say there's going to be one single leader in Collective? Who is the recent Conan, Cyborg, and Helpful King? Via a neuro connector. You mean a thought device? Everyone knows that. The thought device is for ordinary citizens. How long does this go on for? Privileged leadership. This has been, we'll it's been at least 15 minutes. That grant them I'm just going to let it ride. I don't know. Interrupt so even the leaders will be equal. That's a good thing, right? It would be. But Collective can only be launched via the Alpha Connector. It's the key to everything, including assigning discretionary authority. So Dr. Sechenov has the Alpha Connector right now, and Comrade Molotov wants to kick him out of the facility so he can take the Alpha Connector for himself. Exactly. The number of people killed here as a result of Petrov's betrayal is a precious little concern to Comrade Thanks, Molotov. Subduke. He wants to take control of Collective. That's why he's on his way here right now. <sighs> Crispy critters. I never liked that guy. He's always complaining about Sechenov, but I never expected shit like this from him. We gotta hurry. I will probably go back into this VOD to see how long that exposition dump lasted. That was probably the longest uninterrupted lore dump I have ever experienced in a game. Bar none. Like, Yakuza 6, for example, had like an hour-long intro cutscene, but it wasn't just like a full lore dump. It was like a whole experience. It was a fucking cutscene. That was actual just character chatter with what seems to be pretty important dialogue for probably about 20 minutes uninterrupted. Wow. Gamers, when deep conversation lasts more than five minutes, this is the worst way of delivering exposition ever. Non-stop talking during puzzle solving. That would have been fine as a cutscene. Or anything else. A, a journal that I'd read. Anything but that. 
That was a legitimate lore dump. Unrelenting. So this little thing is the reason everything's all jammed up? <laughs> this place is nuts. You can ascend to the surface along with the mirror. For once, you're right. Jesus. I'd probably Jesus. reach Nirvana before I could make it back down the way I came. New upgrade. Have you infiltrated the VDNH yet, Comrade Major? The government's commission's condor has already left Moscow. They'll be here any minute now. If the commission hasn't landed yet, that means there's still time. Just let me work in peace. Shall I report to Dr. Sechenov that it is his requests that prevent you from working? Yeah, you can report on how you ran away from those robots on the maglev platform instead of helping. I am not a soldier, Comrade Major. I am doing intellectual, not menial labor. Smashing robots is your specialty. The only labor you're doing is talking my ear off. Right now, you're wasting my time and slowing down my mission. What? Nothing. Ah, uh, that's what I thought. Oh, what now? An eternity looking at this worthless hunk of junk? The backstabbing machine that killed me? It's a phase. It'll pass. It's a very vengeful I can't even remember my own name anymore. But his metal mug is still there. I still remember the bastard gutting night they told us robots were going to replace us. I'd starve them. Well, they certainly did. Only they did it by slaughtering us all. That's some replacement, isn't it? Oh well. Just leave me alone. I want to doze off. Disagree, the convo makes boring platform less boring and compared to just doing it silently. How? I mean, that's fine to have a different perspective on it, but literally how? It was a conversation where they clearly wanted to make sure everyone understood exactly what was happening, leaving absolutely nothing to the imagination of, so what you're saying is this, which means this, and that must mean this, so are you sure you're saying this? Non-stop. When I'm just doing, like, puzzles. It, it was actual, like, ridiculous jargon <laughs> that, that, that didn't end. During just platform, or not platform, puzzle solving. Not everything needs to be overly explained. Especially not during that as just a throwaway, long, long, long conversation. No, I didn't look. Ugh, whoops. I didn't look for that one. Or paper nearby. Fuck, oh, fine, I'll go through the vent. Dead bodies all over the place. Well, no shit. Tereshkova's arm. What's that metal pervert doing with it? That is a robot waiter. Who's serving the people it killed? I'm gonna smash that fucking bot to bits. The robot isn't currently hostile. We should be able to retrieve the arm without a fight. Leave it to one, Moon. Man, I'm getting a lot of good junk here. Okay, can't reach that one, I guess.
Can't get those. Oh, that was a misclick. Oh, fuck. fuck Whatever. That. There's no way I'm leaving that thing alive. Whatever. I come this far. He's got to be pretty low, right? Yeah. Thanks, the Prime Balgy. What was I looking for? Someone's arm in here or some shit? Kova's hand. Still never found that. It's gotta be in here. Oh, there it is. He's a tier one pussy. The desired procedure. Alright. Is this any good? An improvised two handed axe made of several welded pipes. Apparently, the best melee. Well, I can't even make it right now. Apparently, best melee weapon in the game is the Gushkavgavk. Or something like that. Oh, well, there it is. Zved's Daska. Or whatever. That's apparently the best one. I'll grab it after I finish this mission here. I'm gonna need a lot more materials though. Kind of low. Is collecting junk even worth it? I feel like it'd be better just to kill everything and loot them. I also just hate looting. I'm going through all this shit here. It is worth it. To my neurosensor contacts. Multi key activated. Now what? Now we get ambushed. Hey, Thank hey. you for coming to my aid. Not having the key felt like I was missing a limb. One moment, please. Did we fix her or break her? The Tereshkova is a state-of-the-art model with a self-repairing system. A famous actress and cosmonaut contributed to its creation. I don't give two wet farts. Much better. With your permission, I'd like to deliver a speech now. Greetings, okay. comrades, and welcome to the All-Soviet Exhibition Center! What the fuck are you babbling on about? What speech? You're prancing past piles of dead bodies, and there's blood everywhere. My algorithms are glitching with horror, but my databases lack the verbal and visual tools required to express fear, horror, or other negative emotions. I was created to remain positive and optimistic, no matter what. 
That's a good the protocol. dissonance between my behavior and the gruesome surroundings grosses me out. But there's nothing I can do about it. Uh, I see. I guess nobody expected this to happen. Okay, bye. Set and the, the VDNH to drill the mode. Recent. Drill mode? This Dane. would lead to even greater aggression from passive and physical security systems. It will endanger you and may lead to death of the surviving people, assuming there are still any left. Exactly. If there are any left, this place is a fucking graveyard. Now follow my damn order, bot. You have given me a most peculiar command. All people in this complex have been killed by robots, but you are unharmed. This arouses suspicion. Prove that you are a human. I will not follow the orders of a robot pretending to be one. And how am I supposed to do that? Commit seppuku? You must pass the Darwin test. This will prove that you are a human. What the fuck? What test? How about I just rip your head off, huh? Without her help, activating drill mode will take too much time. I gladly confirm this information. Fine, knock yourself out. Hit me with this damn Darwin test of yours. What am I supposed to do? Prove that you are human, Pioneer Nichayev. Put three items on this pedestal that represent the three main values of a Soviet citizen. Art, labor... Couldn't a robot life. do that easily? Crispy critters, now I gotta oh, deal with another crazy ass That should be a tip-off that I'm human, for, and perhaps a Redditor. Fucking bullshit. nothing but crispy critters. Holy shit. Jesus Christ. Okay, what? I don't see how this proves my humanity, but... Okay. Let's go this way. It's strange, but the Tereshkova loves them. Even though she's a robot. Don't ever say that to me again. Flowers. Give her flowers. Oh. Some robots are almost human, and some humans are almost robots. Not heavy enough. Strange times we live in. Well, Damn it. Living. Not heavy enough. I'm out of boxes. Oh. God, son of a bitch. Crispy critters. There we go. Wait, where do I put it? Where are the pedestals? Where, where, where are the pedestals? Do I talk to you? Do I talk to you? Where's the pedestals? So... Yes! Hear the springs cheerful him. Oh, Be yourself, strive and earn. Life, I love you, and hope you love me in return. God, shut your face, you dumbass toaster. I'm sorry. All this chaos is causing my emotional algorithms to malfunction. Thought I was supposed to go one at a time here, but it looks like it's just to dump all three and then progress. Yeah, I don't know what that says. Uh, what am I doing in here? Maybe one more. Maybe I just give this to you anyway. So, uh, yes, I am. Okay, that's no. Nope. So I got this one, I got the one on the other side, there's one more. Where? 
You can't open that door over there, so it's got to be out here, I guess. Yes. Just watch your fingers. I'd rather not have to look for that multi key again. <sighs> the hammer, tool of working men. The sickle, peasant's friend. The many pointed star they praise and with their lives defend. <sighs> Put something cheerful on, would you? It kind of feels like the end of the world right now. Radio of the future! Astonishing music generated by the state-of-the-art quantum supercomputer based on the preferences and tendencies of the modern performers. The theory of relativity claims these are the songs that the citizens of the future will be Seb listening Coley. to. But the citizens of today are already listening to it. Doesn't that mean this is going to be the music of the past once we actually get there? And nobody's going to write it 30 years from now because it already exists. The music of the future could change every second. Well, beloved well dub -dub, spotted, dub dub indeed. You have discovered a temporal paradox. How very observant you are. The music of the future shapes the music style in the present. However, the superposition of the observer and the information Thanks, being perceived Nifty. are located within a self-consistent loop. In layman's terms, we are always listening to the music of the future and determining what it is going to be like at the same time. Oh, shit. If that's layman's terms, I'd hate to hear the complicated explanation. I'm getting a fucking headache here. Pioneer Nichayev, you passed the Darwin test with flying colors. Tell me, what do you want to be when you grow up? A cosmonaut. What a splendid career choice. I think the bit's orange. Well, I rather enjoy your attention, Major. Now, how can I help you? Do you have a memory leak or something? I need to announce a drill and put the VDNH into drill mode. Unfortunately, this is beyond my ability. Are you yanking my fucking chain? But I can provide you with a solution. You see, a single robot cannot engage the military drill mode. Such procedure requires the presence of two robots instead of one. So where do I find another obnoxious metal dipshit? Before that Prime dreadful Damien. nightmare, the information hall was staffed by the two of us. But during the failure, the berserking robots took my partner, Claire, apart. I have to find did all of her pieces. Her all over the complex or something? Precisely. How did you know, dear comrade? Call it a hunch. Do I have to scour the entire VDNH for her parts? Plug the administrative control drive into me, so I can tell you where the pieces of poor Claire currently are. Well, that sure beats looking for him blind. Thanks, Risa. So where's the administrative Boner. control drive? I'm running out of Boner time. Rising. Please follow me. This whole thing is just monstrous. The robots must have completely lost their minds. Can I go ahead or? I mean, I imagine she's just gonna end up down here anyway, so it should be fine. Oh my god, she doesn't move unless I'm right next to her, huh? Is it because of exposition? Oh my, would you look at this? Helping lumberjacks and first Oof. responders is such a noble goal. But you, uh... how you use the arms our creators have given you. Like a primitive animal. Like a beast to crush and dismember. Oh god, we're gonna go side to side all the way down the stairs. It just stands there buck naked, as if nothing were wrong. Have you no shame, robot? Publicly exposing your iridium compactor. 
You do realize he didn't do it himself, right? Thanks for the resub, Suzuki. Oh and my, Joe. that's a mess. And who, I wonder, will have to clean it up? I should dispatch the cleaners this instant. No, wait. It's the cleaners that did it. I'm so scatterbrained today. Oh, I envy you humans. You can just pick up a razor and shave that horrible monstrous mustache off. But this one, you're not even a machine, you nitwit. You're just an imitation, a caricature, a piece of lab equipment. Pardon the outburst. It's just that one of them used to try to... Oh, well, let's change the subject. All right, There's we'll change the subject. Let's go. Of the lab tech models, the ones in black, turned out to be especially vicious. They've been using their harmless built-in range-finding laser to pick off humans from a distance. How did it ever come to this? Just so you know, the black lab tech specialization is determined by the software package encoded within a specially constructed Kinetico Scholar Neurogel capsule. You can salvage this package from one of the defeated black lab techs, provided its capsule is still Things in one prime piece. Unlikely. What? I didn't understand a single thing you just said. You're an assistant, Tereshkova. Talk human. Shocking. You have no sense of decency. I gather you've already met Nora, the monstrous repair vendor who's subjecting humans to unimaginable deadly torture. It pains my algorithms to have to send you into her bloody clutches, but we have no choice. She's the only mechanism capable of utilizing this capsule to upgrade your weapons. Yeah, yeah, move your ass, Tereshkova. We're in a hurry. On my way, comrade. Swings a bit large. Um, very mixed on it. Who's a good boy? Who's the sweetest, silliest, chubbiest little boy? You little goo. You don't attack people even when you're in combat mode because you're such a little sweetie, isn't that right? Aren't you precious? Here we are, comrade. The administrative control drive should be at this booth. Please establish the connection. I'm ready. Only try to be gentle, comrade major. I have very delicate internals. Oh, what just snapped? Relax, bot. That's my joints cracking. Does this look all right? Administrator level rights granted successfully. What now? I'm opening the door to the atrium for you. Search each of the complex's floor and find my dear Claire. I'll be in touch over the radio. As soon as you reach a floor, I'll scan it for my poor friend's parts. Most of her is on the ground floor. Please put her back together again. Okay. All right, all right. Wow, check this place out. It's like a palace. Talk about class. Let me just drink it all in. Attention, DNH staff. Visiting hours. So I guess it just cleans the floor, huh? Please conclude all maintenance and proceed to your workstation. He's a prime dusty. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? What? Jesus Christ, I'm trying to listen to her. I hate that dropkick so much. Holy shit. Where'd he just go? Did he? Okay. Ah. 
I'm afraid there's nothing I can do for you now. If you're concerned about me being deceased, you don't have to worry. It is indeed too late for that now. Then what's the matter? You see, I am a tour guide. The last living... Oh, I mean, non-robotic. Oh, this is really difficult. I get it. So? I did such a solemn concluding tour before handing over all functions to these Tereshkovas. And I had a group of students. They underwent polymer treatment and were awarded... Does talking to these to the people facility. ever do anything? Talk about bad timing. Exceptionally bad Or is it all timing. just, like, you additional see, lore I stuff? Worried about like, is there a side there quest line or anything? Because I haven't got any from them. The I understand that you should be evacuating, but you can obviously take care of yourself. You are a security guard, aren't you? Something like that. Find them, please. They scattered when everything started. I can't leave them. This one sounds like a side quest. I answer for their well-being with my life. I did it again, didn't I? All right, calm down. Thank you. Oh god. Oh. I'm stuck. I can't move. Okay. Oh, he freed me, he freed me. Thanks, big guy. It is so easy to get it stuck on shit in this game, my god. Said most of the parts are on the ground floor, so I'll grab them from here. I hate it, I hate that. God damn it. Easy resub stick. Please resub J Mac. Great. So where am I even supposed to look? I swear on my cooling unit, these mustached perverts must have dragged her into the maintenance room. I'm on oh my boy. Not the maintenance room. That's like the robot bang bus. Oh goodness gracious. Oh god. Don't worry. Um, this place used to be really nice. The fuck is Until the name of the one I'm helping? Killed. Not Claire. It is a most the tragic sight. I already forgot. Oh, shit. 
paying attention. Oh. Uh, why is it not rotating? Oh, because I'm rotating it the wrong way. I keep missing it by one. Oh my god. My little reptile brain's overloading. Stop. Why can't I change it? Still backwards. Still backwards. Oh my god, why, why am I having such a hard time figuring out how to fix this so it's not backwards? Does this fix it? There. No, nope, one too far. backwards again. Oh my god! Oh, my brain can't handle this now. Thanks, you some hot shot. Fuck. I'm tilted. I'm so tilted. No, I've really fucked it up. Hold on. Does this reset it? No, it doesn't. It does. Thank god. What? This is new. You may need to apply spatial reasoning here. There's no may about it. These locks of yours are really something, you know that? Do I not shock those? Hey, Charlie. Why couldn't they just put regular, more reliable locks anywhere? Like with codes and shit? I suspect it's because if they had, anyone who hacked the code would be able to open the locks without authorization. Yeah, but now anyone who solves the puzzles can get through. In other words, pretty much anybody. Neuroconnectors from Sechenov's team look like. The special neuroconnectors have the Greek letter Gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? 
Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter beta on them, but the beta connectors were real at first. Uh, I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors Can I not were discretionary use these magnets? What is the point of them? Connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to Assuming I can't run like on this, right? So, what happened to him? Oh, After okay. the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuro connectors. Enhanced gamma models, shaped like bracelets, were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? Pavlov, Korolyov, Kurchatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filomonenko, and Chelome? Indeed. Not like this. Oh my god. I can't. Tough. Unlucky. Uh... What do the special neuro connectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuro connectors have the Greek letter gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter Beta on them, but the Beta connectors were real at first. Uh, I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority were called Beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov these rings from the moon's special Did I do that? Enhanced gamma models shaped like bracelets were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? For Vavilov, Kuroliov, Kachatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filipinenko, and Chelome? Indeed. Okay, do I have to melee this? How many times do I have to shoot this thing in the middle? Oh, now I'm, I'm fucked. Jesus. How many times do I have to shoot that thing? Let's reset Judo in the bits, Sark. What do the special neuro connectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuro connectors have the Greek letter Gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter beta on them. But the beta connectors were real at first. Uh, I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority oh, were called beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuro connectors. Enhanced gamma models shaped like bracelets were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those connectors. Pavlov, Korolyov, Kurchov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filomonenko, and Chelome? Indeed. That laser. No way, right? People never stop talking in this game, do they? No. Literally, never ever. Not even for a millisecond. But look at all these nice little guys. Something I could climb up. Mm. 
Let's see what all of these are. can't spin that, right? Not from a distance. <clears throat> There'd be no reason for this to be here if I couldn't use it. That's gotta be the way to do it. Thanks to the bits. Ho. Oh. And yeah, overall ho. Oh. simpler. All I have to do is just drop down. Now I imagine I can actually change this on the magnets. Or not. I thought that would maybe push it up. this for Thank one of Claire's, Claire's little legs. There. Yeah, the truth is out there. I've never seen bots like these before. Oh, you know. Okay, immediately fuck me up. This robot is very dangerous in melee combat. Uh, oh, so that's why I'm getting my ass kicked. Okay, there, I'm dead. Wait, do I not take damage in weapon wheel? I do. That would have been a huge discovery. I've never seen bots like these before. I thought I had my shotgun out still. This robot is I'm stuck. Okay. What a disaster. Oh, so that's where I get my ass kicked. Holy. Jesus. Major, one of my dear Claire's legs is most certainly there. Yeah, I've never seen bots like these before. What the fuck? This robot is very dangerous in melee combat. Oh, so that's why I'm getting my ass kicked. Damn. 
Oh, why did they instant drop? Oh god. That thing has like actually just more health than the boss. Thanks for your right wise. Boss. Damn. Thanks, you resub crying. Facility service rooms, Major. One of Dear Claire's legs is most certainly there. Yeah, the truth is out there, right? In the prime blush. You asked for it. I've never seen bots like these before. This robot is very dangerous in melee combat. <laughs> oh, so that's why I'm getting my ass kicked. I'm, oh god, I hit, oh, I'm so fucked, I hit that thing. I'm trying to like, bunny hop my way around here. Can it hit me up here? Oh, I can't even climb that. This seems like a big oversight. Dr. Sechenov wearing a bracelet before. Does his Alpha Connector look different? Indeed it does. His device is unique, and its shape and location are one of Dr. Sechenov's deepest secrets. So his Alpha Connector must be really well guarded. Who's watching the Argentum? Entrusting humans Corbula? with the Connector would be far too risky. Coco. It's guarded by Dr. Sechenov's personal bodyguards. You mean the ballerina twins? The way they move, they're so graceful and elegant. They kind of remind me of something. Here's your leg. Do yourself a pair thing. <laughs> cool tech. <laughs> oh. Still quite a few more parts. Bother. No scanning cycle. Module, limb, arm, right, found. Location, Vavilov floor. Transmission obstructed. Data incomplete. <sighs> What's the holdup? Why can't we locate the module this time? I'm afraid I can't help you. There's some kind of interference on this floor. Possible sources of interference include electromagnetic shielding, or the presence of a large, elongated object. A large, elongated object? That sounds odd. Wow. There's a big honking thing in here. Oh Lots shit, it's of one of those, bunkers. uh, drill thing. Oh god. Okay, that's the same cheese that doesn't work on these guys.
Pretty cool song. Okay. He just immediately went for me. Didn't even bother trying to repair that. Alright, give me two seconds. I want to pee real quick. Thanks to Resub Crocodile and the Parambongo. Alright, I'm back. Thanks to Resub. Gorky, Stalking, Octopi, and Blitz. What is this, a kid's game? That oh, is a snake. Okay. Nice. What's it for? I believe it. I, I, need, to, I need to get off of this. Okay, you have to repair off. Things the resub here on. That was an easy game of snake. Holy fuck, Charles! Is that the process I just activated? Run. Where? Hey, hey, what the hell are you doing, damn it? You metal son of a bitch. You scared the ever living fuck out of me. That was close. Well, whatever. I got the arm. This looks like the right one. Let's go find the rest. Do I have to kill these? That really looked like I could jump over it. Um, well, that's where this one ends. Tough. Bitch, you scared the ever living fuck out of me. That was close. Well, whatever. I got the arm. I guess I do have to kill these. Click the right one. Let's go find the rest. A little too high. Ah, you're tough, toaster. What? Is there one behind me? Give me a health pack here, eh? Okay, who's hitting me? From way downtown, eh? Okay, that was big for me. Surely that's the last one. Oh god. Do I have to kill them too? What the fuck?
Okay. Charles, I why did the boss take the real beta connectors out of commission? Were they defective? Not entirely. Dr. Sechenov wasn't convinced that there was any need for discretionary authority within Collective. So the boss wanted total equality, but Molotov's schemes changed his mind. Perhaps so, comrade. <clears throat> what do you mean? Oh my ass? god, the little vacuum butt hit me. Dr. Sechenov wanted equality. I for didn't everyone. even know I could do that. Yeah, okay. I wonder if they can hit me during good. a little scene. Actually, deaggroed them as well. Please let me up. No! This is terrible! It plunged into something warm and sticky. Oh my, it is red polymer. Disgusting! What does this even mean? I am sorry, dear comrade. This is the only data I have available. I hope I managed to help you. You sure did. What a nice lady. Pardon me. Access granted. What is what is this? I haven't used that a single time. It's a Molotov. Okay. It's for my pistol. It's a cartridge for my melee weapon. Might as well use that. No, 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 that's not what I meant to do. Oh, fuck. How do I use the cartridge again? It's in my inventory. At least I think it was a cartridge, right? Middle mouse, thank you. Nope, maybe that wasn't a cartridge in my inventory. Access granted. What is that? Oh, that's my- is that the empty one I use? No, it wouldn't be in my inventory if it was empty. Why didn't it work? Because you're missing the upgrade for it? Oh. Uh, I didn't realize that was per weapon. Okay. Yeah, you're right. That's for the cartridge. I'll just save the cartridge then for when I get the better melee weapon. I've got a ton of material. I can make the Dominator, is this any good? Yeah, it's pretty good. I'm gonna make it then. What does it use? Is it energy? Yeah, it's energy. Thanks, Resub Simon. Wow, a lock. Didn't see that coming. What, what is this? 
Oh, I didn't even see the red one at the bottom. What's that crap in the canisters? Be careful! That is a specimen called Pliush, or Ivy. It is extremely dangerous. Yeah, I've seen this crap before. And of course, the ripped off arm is in there too. Why could it just be lying in a corner somewhere? Oh my goodness. Uh, There's so many things I keep running into, holy shit. Maybe learn how to read. It's resistant to gunfire. I use the resub cuz in beast mode. There, I'll let you here. This will be a good uh, assignment for you to practice your third grade reading skills. It's the first sentence there. Okay, and that should have been plenty of time for you. What's that crap in the canisters? Be careful! That is a specimen called Pliush, or Ivy. It is extremely dangerous. Yeah, I've seen this crap before. And of course, the ripped off arm is in there too. Why could it just be lying in a corner somewhere? Oh my god, immediately running over the canisters. Bitch. 
was here. So I come in. I can't see. Let's hope another one of those freaks doesn't come crawling out of the next canister. According to my data, the second canister is sealed properly. There's recent Turkey and Tier 1 Have Damien. Have you infiltrated the VTNH yet, Major? The government commission is almost here. I'm inside. Looking for a way to activate military drill mode. Maybe Things there. have been complicated by a shitload of weird shit. Any more questions? Well, look faster. Don't uh, let Dr. Sechenov down again. Speaking of weird shit. Let me grab another one of these. Can I replace shock? I feel like it'd be worth it. Oh, I don't even need to replace. Oh, I forgot you have two of these. That seems good. Let's try that. Sub cope. Whoa. Hey! Why isn't anybody working? Let's see how this goes. Oh, you only get the block. One that is like a hold for X amount of damage kind of thing. Oh, that time I actually got it for a lot longer. Okay, okay, holy shit. Let's try the Dominator out. Okay, that secondary fire looks much better. Please move from the chair.
cool song in that one. Charles, so after the whole beta connector idea was dead, they made the neuro connectors with discretionary authority? I'm afraid so. The power struggle in the Kremlin will never end. The party elite insisted on having power. So the recharge of energy, well, that's rights. not the for, USSR. like, my energy are. weapon, right? It's but for my abilities, I imagine, for on Earth, since it comes from my shield, or is it actually just general country. energy, like, we for the weapon and everything? We can't let and collective. Why not? Collective was designed as a worldwide union for, for the weapon too. human beings, okay. where robots will do everything for them. Everyone will have the same opportunities. The capitalists won't like the sound of that. Unfortunately, no one in power will see equality as an appeal. Okay, that went down so at the worst time. Being crushed by the Kremlin, Dr. Sechenov programmed discretionary authority into Collective. I see. Oh, thank you, vacuum bot. Oh, he's still alive. Please shoot me with the light. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, very sad. Almost. Nope. What's up? Still buzzing? What the fuck? What the fuck? Still not convinced it can actually shoot through that. I've hit that thing a thousand times before with the shotgun. My god, how many are there here? There's a lot of bad boys. Where are their bodies? Okay. Here's your left arm. Here's the <laughs> Go prime. Ahead and fix yourself up. Kawakumi. Last piece, I think. All right. Just the head. No little surprise mystery pieces. I'm stuck. Jesus. I, another one. I haven't seen him scan yet. Why would I? This isn't going to tell me anything useful. 
killed a million of these. I'm... Please! Oh my god. The second you touch anything in the environment, you can't move for a second. Holy lord. Scanning the exhibition area. Module head found. Establishing coordinates. Shit, it's dark here. I got a bad feeling about this. Ooh, a new upgrade. The Neptune Complex is an underwater city that has been located at the bottom of Lake Lazur since 1944. The complex is a one-of-a-kind research facility. <laughs> Vacuum bot, please? I, why didn't you turn on? What are you gawking at? Right into me, huh? What, what? I, I really am trying to hit the robot behind you. Ton of loot coming up. I don't know if I'm always new to the game. It's already been out for like a week. It's already kind of late. We'll see. I haven't decided fully yet. Hey Socks, hope you're doing well man. Thanks to reset Big Mike and Sawi. the shit ass way out of here underground or something is there something over there that this thing's protecting <laughs> oh. 
Where is the shit ass way out of there? Must be over here through the sewers. Oh, well, you mean the sewers. Things the bits F9. Oh no, there's no way I finish the game tonight, not even close. Where am I supposed to find the head? You need to enter Icarus Hall. It is located on the second story of this venue. So where's the entrance? Unfortunately, I actually have no idea if this thing was hostile. I just started swinging. Mixed up after the malfunction. It was Shit, Sherlock. Be hostile, have you no considered doubt. powering the beluga? How is that supposed to help? I don't know. It's just a suggestion. Well, I guess it can't hurt to try. It's not like we've got a lot of other options. Tereshkova. Where's the power room around here? At the very top. <laughs> Fantastic. So we're cut off. Just what I always wanted. Things are resub too lit. The bits dialing. The Beluga is the world's fastest multi-purpose submersible vehicle. It can reach speeds of up to 78 kilometers per hour and is able to carry out There's civilian Jimbo. and military missions at depths down to 3,000 meters. We've learned more about the ocean floor over the last few years than we had during the previous century. Let's not get into this right now, okay? So, what was wrong with the real beta connectors? Since Collective was originally planned without any discretionary authority, everyone in it was supposed to be equal. Yeah, we already talked about that. Then why'd they need the beta connectors? To secure Collective against unforeseen threats from individuals who might wish to control it. That's impossible. Everybody's equal in Collective. Shit! The Alpha Connector! Indeed. Intruders or an opposition force among equals could try to obtain the Alpha Connector. This could lead to human casualties, which would be unacceptable. So how could beta connectors stop this from happening? They didn't give their carriers oh any God. discretionary authority, but they did allow them to be present within Collective without being a part of it. In other words, they had total autonomy while retaining access to the information. Oh, so shit. What? That's basically Another what we upgrade. have right now. You're seeing this from a human perspective. What other kind of perspective could I... Oh, crap. The boss wanted to put beta rings on some robots so no one else in Collective could control them. Indeed they are. At first, Dr. Sechenov planned to order his loyal twins to guard the Alpha Connector. So where's the very top? I really thought that was just gonna kill it. Okay.
Oh my god, I can just go. Get, thought I had to go thing to thing. this way. What are you guarding? Oh god, here comes a drop here. Sub Sydney. I I don't know what that did, but I have no faith in this working. Oh my god, that's huge. That's big. Oh. What was the point in coming over here? There's... There's nothing over here. What the fuck? I could've just jumped up those, I see. This is where the power comes from. I don't even Are want to you from sure? You. Definitely. How? Because this place has my favorite thing in the whole fucking world. A relay. Really? I thought you were more partial to canisters. Oh, come on. Wait, but I, I didn't get the head. Thanks to Resub Isaac in Tier One Licorice. This actually put me back outside. <laughs> oh wait, I see. This isn't like fully. Out oh, it is fully outside. Oh fuck. I thought that closed the door, it didn't. Why did I come over here then? Just for that relay? I thought I wanted the head. Where 
Where's this go? How do I get up to you? You playing with that man's corpse? Thanks, you resub, cuzzy. Let's see if this thing helps. Tereshkova, do you okay, copy? Okay. Yes, dear comrade. The communication is restored. So, where's that head of yours? My head is where it's supposed to be. <laughs> Looks like a maze for kids. This will be a cakewalk. Is it a maze? Oh, it's one of those like physics ones I see all the way at the end. Jumpy little thing, ain't ya? Holy shit, please. Stop. How do I rotate you, huh? Hey, I think I get it. Looking good. Let's do it this way. That way I can get a better look at you. Now oh, we're getting somewhere. Bring it around town. Oh my god. Oh, please. Jiminy Christmas. 
Do you have any idea what you're doing, there Major? Just a sec. There we go. <laughs> yeah! Gotcha! Let us nice! Fall. Easy. When warmth and beauty mingle. Thanks, you said total guy. He's a prime micro. Yes, found the head. We gotta keep moving. Charles, any idea how much time we got left? I cannot say for sure, but definitely not much. Finally, I got all her parts. Shortcut. That didn't work. Charles, so after Dr. Sechenov created the new Gamma Connectors, he destroyed the old Beta Connectors, right? Officially, yes. But only the technology used to manufacture the Beta Connectors was destroyed. The pair of experimental rings were simply removed from all records and declared recycled. Why go to all that trouble? He didn't want to destroy the fruits of his painstaking labor. Dr. Sechenov simply kept them as souvenirs. Shit! Can you so die to fall now? damage? I don't they think I have yet. somewhere in the Sechenov Science Center here at facility 3826. They apparently disappeared after the malfunction began. Apparently. You see what's going right. on here, don't you? Installing the go. head. No one knows it. Big skip. Welcome back, Claire. It's assembled. What now? Self repair procedure complete. I am ready for service. Thank you, comrade. We will now initiate the launch sequence. First launch code sequence generated. Please confirm that launch code sequence is matched. Second launch code sequence generated. Launch code sequence is matched. Initiating BDNH mode of operational change. New mode, military drill. Whew, I think we made it. Thanks, ladies. Thank you, dear comrade. Whoa, uh oh. Please, comrade Molotov. Jesus, is that Thank Joe you. Biden? It's not safe here. So it's still dangerous. Jesus Christ. I was told everything was under control. There was a minor issue, but Major Nichaev, uh, forgive me, Agent P3, has already dealt with it. What exactly did he deal with? There's blood all over the place. That's not blood. It's paint. Comrade Sechenov. You're playing a dangerous game here. Greetings, Comrade Molotov. I don't follow you. What game? You know what I'm talking about, Comrade Sechenov. Your local malfunction is actually a worldwide catastrophe. Your robots in combat mode. Countless human casualties. Need I go on? Please go on, actually. Oh, please do. Oh, yes. But first I'd like to know how you obtained this information. From Viktor Vasilyevich Petrov, your engineer, an outstanding roboticist, an honored citizen of the Soviet Thanks, you, That's Samwise. what he used to be. Now he's prisoner number 230385, sentenced to community service at the Vavilov complex. By your order, you are in direct violation of Soviet law. As a minister, the minister of industry, you know the consequences. Here is the Procurator General's decree. The upcoming launch of the Collective Neural Network will be cancelled, and you'll be the subject of a full-fledged investigation. Am I making myself clear, Comrade Sechenov? Comrade Molotov, may I have a word with you in private? <laughs> Do you really think that's going to change anything? <laughs> Fine. 
I'll meet you here in 15 minutes. Mikael, meet me at the landing pad. Right away, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> Aren't you in a hurry to see your master, Major? Stockhausen seems awfully eager. Is something wrong, Major? Major, I asked you a question. Crispy critters, what's going on? Why, all of a sudden, now we can't talk? What's going on? I said lock the door. He can't shut the fuck up during the game, but now all of a sudden he's gone completely mute. He must have snapped and killed all of them. Because Sechenov has programmed him. That's my guess. Come to me. Oh. <sighs> I can't remember anything prior to some injury two years ago. Sechenov saved him. Cool apple in the shitter. Nice. I think it's very clear that Sechenov has like rewired his brain to do all of his bidding. I'm not collecting these apples. The resub Vinny and tier one meets and the resub Rocco. And no. Oh, what a save. Holy shit. That would have been an incredible time loss. Wake up, my what? I'm a furry? What the fuck? Oh, maybe I was like a mascot at the parade or something. P3, my boy. You're alive. Uh, I guess so, yeah. Comrade Sechenov! The government commission... they're dead. More yeah, that was pretty obvious. Here. What about the others? How many people were with him? F Fifteen or so. Some of them may have survived. Find out. Uh, what the fuck happened here? Who the fuck did this? Guess the robots got in. You were fortunate to escape unharmed. C Comrade Sechenov, all the members of the commission are dead. All of them. This is tragic, but it changes nothing. Collective must still be activated. I couldn't agree more. But what should we do with the dead Politburo member? We don't have a lot of options here. Right? Handle it. Mikhail, head to the radio station and make sure power to the government... Who could have done this? Yes, sir, but the Kremlin will be expecting a report from Comrade Molotov. I will personally inform the Politburo of this tragedy. Hurry, Mikhail. We don't have much time. Left. Help her. How are you doing, my boy? Not good. I failed you again. This is... too much. It's too much for all of us. This terrible incident. Are they doing an interpretive dance to send them to the afterlife? What is this? What does this all mean?
pretty cool. That was a nice scene. So she carries gold bricks in her goo. Oh wow, Sechenov put uh, nipples on them. Wait, I just noticed that. You little scallywag. Yeah, oh. Wait, and. Wait, what the fuck? He put nipples and you can see the areola. Not even the coldest day in winter in the real world can you see areola through a fucking shirt. Wow. This man knows how to build a robot. air in the prime bow and copycat. What the fuck is happening? Did we capture his spirit? Oh, we're cloning him. Was it successful? Did we make a... Or did we... Transmit a new soul into the body of Molotov? Oh, nope. That... I thought for sure that was the plan. If we were just going to... <laughs> disintegrate him... What we... We could have just used normal acid. To the that was... Significantly Sechenov. more effort than that needed to be. We've got a problem. You could have just used like hydrofluoric acid. Someone is trying to send information to the West. Who? Who could have done that? There are only two people who could have done it. You and Petrov. Petrov's dead. I saw his body. Just his body. Petrov is first and foremost a head. It was his body. How's that possible? Philato. There's a tier one racing. When your accomplice is a neurosurgeon of Dr. Falatova's caliber, then anything is possible. Have you traced the signature? Petrov is masking his signature, but I'm sure he's in one, one of the scientific centers. Did you hear that, my boy? Go find him. Right now. That was a cool scene. I don't really understand why we went through all that effort just to Charles. Uh, what the hell happened? Get rid of the evidence. There? What exactly are you asking about? Who killed the government commission? How did I survive? Sorry, I cannot help you. You suddenly lost consciousness as though you'd been struck from behind. When that happened, I was also disabled. Liar. What was that monster the glove made of red polymer? That was the a glove neuropolymer nose. data storage. A data storage? What does it store? Dead bodies? The boss said it was a tribute to the departed. What's that got to do with data? You will have to ask Dr. Sechenov himself. For my part, all I can say is that Professor Zaharov died the exact same way. This is fucking nuts. I really thought the polymer was harmless. 
<sighs> Fair enough. Find Petrov and return to Chelome as soon as possible. This will be the best outcome for everyone. Charles, why did that monster, you know, the red polymer thing, the, the data storage, why did it look like a person? Dr. Sechenov's idea. He wanted it to move independently. Why would a data storage need to walk around? So it could run off someplace and get lost along with all its important information? It won't run off. It's as loyal to Dr. Sechenov as the Thanks, ballerina Dave. twins. When Dr. Sechenov releases it into the outside world, it always remains near him as an additional security measure. Security? So it can attack people. What do you think, Comrade Major? Why would a neuropolymer substance capable of dissolving a human being in mere seconds need to be able to move independently? Shit on a shingle. You're telling me that Jelly Man can sneak up behind someone and kill them instantly without leaving a trace. It does remind me of a certain person who died under mysterious circumstances and without witnesses after slipping and falling into a bath. Crispy critters. Yeah, makes you think. Wow. It's all coming together. Who would have thought so that Charles, the doctor is evil? Doctor said you. You've got a big fight ahead of you. More enemies incoming. Charles, how could that prick Petrov send intel to the west? The facility's under lockdown. Petrov cannot transfer anything directly to anyone. Or he would have already done Whoa. so. That is why he is attempting to deceive collective central control. Are you talking about that big ass ball floating in the sky? You mean Petrov's somewhere close by. I oh, wait, so. let me get that melee yeah. weapon. How do I... how do I move around the map? The fuck? I don't... not WASD... Can't right click and drag... Oh! Left click and drag. Man, where is that weapon? I thought it was gonna be at one of the training grounds. That's what chat said uh, last time I played this. Is it not? The vet, yeah, the Vestoshka. I'm sorry to hear that, it's awful. I'm sorry to hear that, Polo. Or Poyo. That was wholesome, thanks for the kind words. Racing, Will Racing. Yeah, so everyone's getting it at different places. The blueprints are randomized, but I thought it was gonna be at one of the testing grounds. Are there more testing grounds I haven't discovered? Is that why I don't see it yet? Most communication between facility 3826 and the outside world. This block cannot be overcome. An entire scientific academy would be required. Five star. Such as the Academy of Consequences. Then what's he hoping to accomplish? As you have no doubt already observed, there is one communication channel connected to the outside world that is not subject to the emergency protocol. The secret government line. Quite right. That channel is used by Dr. Sechenov to contact the Kremlin. No one else has access to it. Yeah, no one except Granny Zena. So, what's Petrov trying to pull? I believe he is trying to dupe the central hub by passing himself off as Dr. Sechenov. That son of a bitch. Charles, is there really a chance Petrov could fool the hub? It wasn't exactly programmed by morons, right? They must have put protections in place. Petrov is a talented engineer and programmer. 
There's a reason he made it to Facility 3826. He's the one who optimized the programmer-to-robot and robot-to-robot -robot digital data transfer protocols. So he knows better than anyone how the central hub works. Does that mean Petrov could actually fool the hub? Then why did Dr. Access granted. So you said I can mark it in here on the map. How? He's a bit Kirby in the resub five star. Let's get some queef. So I can't, I can't mark it. Chat was wrong. Snowball is better crafted now. Is it? Because chat was saying this Fez Dashka is the best weapon. Snowball seems like the second best. Snowball is not better. Yeah, I'm looking up. Yeah, this vet, this Zezdaska Dashka definitely does seem to be best. The one I'm currently using, the Pashtet, is second. Oh, but if you use the Zez Dashka, you can't use any of the polymer abilities. Makes the resub feel good. No, that's not true. Oh, according to this, you can. You can't. Alright, I'll write that one off as unreliable. Here, how to get the Zezdoshka. Zezdoshka is the strongest melee weapon in Atomic Heart, and you can get it relatively early on in the game, just after getting out of Vavilov. You'll find yourself in a village with your objective being to find an exit, starting from logs. This is going to be the Red House, which I didn't have the blueprint for the Zezdoshka. I instead got a uh, pile of shit, so it's not helpful. It's literally just randomized. That's super unlucky. So where are all the places it can be? Let's see. Does someone have a map of all the chests? You'll get it eventually. Yeah. It's none of the testing grounds I already checked. Is it resub Virologi? Might be a different sector then. Well, can you... Chat was saying you can only get weapon upgrades from testing grounds. And not weapon blueprints. I found mine in training ground one. I'll just I'll just wait for it to pop up on a fucking training ground then as opposed to looking all over the place. Let me double check all these, make sure I didn't miss it. Uh, not there. Not 
there. Man, I wish you could like zoom out a little more or easily navigate this. Thanks to the Prime Teddy. I just looked. There's something for the Zezdashka in this one, the reverse shot, but it's not the actual blueprint. Yeah, that's it, none of these. Son of a bitch. I can't move, so this is super fucked. Sometimes you get it at the end of the game. Uh, that'd be really sad. Like, even if I... Like, in the training grounds at the end of the game? Or do you mean, like, even if I went to every single house and looted everything? Some pants. It's not random, there's a set discovery order. Well, you're just blatantly wrong because the spot in the video where a guy gets a de says Dashka is not where I got it. Unless you mean by like order of every discovery ever following the similar path, but even then, I don't think that's accurate either. This is the wrong way. Man, so much junk.
looking good. Should be able to upgrade the fuck out of the Zezdashka when I finally get it. Cool plant. Okay, this is bad. Please stop climbing things. disc speedrun strat nice Sleep well, Nate. Hey, what's up, friends? Look what we have here. You killed him. That's enough, Victor. So much death. I just knocked him out. He's unconscious, okay? Be or not to be, that is the question. Whether it is noble in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against the your troubles, and by opposing in them, you know, it's, it's all wrong, it's all wrong. I don't agree. I'm sorry, Larissa, but I don't understand. He ruined everything, and you, you! I'm a doctor. Enough people have died today. People, Larissa! He's an animal! He'll rip anybody's throat out of such enough orders him to. Victor, he's tied up. I'll program a treatment and then we'll go. Go where? No one's coming for Thanks, us. Thanks, Charles. And this fucking lunatic's ruined our escape plan. I know. We'll come up with something. I doubt it. <laughs> Just let me go, and I promise I'll make it quick. <laughs> And painless. So such enough talk and talk, huh? Look, he just came to and he's already threatening us. <laughs> yeah, I am threatening you. How many people have your robots slaughtered without so much as a warning? Petrov? Two thousand? Three thousand? That's 000? not Victor's fault. It was a local <sighs> malfunction. A local malfunction? Then why the shit doesn't your boyfriend have a scratch on him, huh? <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? Isn't it obvious? First Vavilov, then the VDNH. The robots are attacking everyone except you two. Why is that? Oh if you're not shit! Controlling them. <laughs> Victor, you said you had nothing to do with this. <laughs> and you believed him. What other bullshit has this guy told you? <laughs> oh man. Victor. I had no choice. A simple malfunction wouldn't Thanks have changed reset. anything. Dryden. How could you? Huh? How could I? You said it yourself. The whole world might end. No, don't touch me. I think you have some smoky. <laughs> you really didn't tell her anything, did you? <laughs> A big mistake. Hey, what the hell? Oh, not the chair. 
Hey, Larissa, wait! Larissa! Nothing can save you now, asshole. I'll just hang out, I guess. P3 to Chelome. Petrov got away. Again. Well, they couldn't have gone far. It's only been a few seconds. Commander Chayev. Petrov must not interfere with the launch of Collective. Find the criminal. Now. You have drawn the wizard's ire, Comrade Major. No shit. Get off my grill, will ya? This one's awfully far away. We'll hopefully can find a car. Already free, Major? Oh, what, did you not expect to hear from me? Not only can I hear you just fine, I'm gonna see you real soon, too. So get ready, prick. Trust me, the preparations are well underway. There will be surprises, dog. You, said, Dane. you turn Larissa against me, bitch. She doesn't return my calls. Yeah, you're breaking my heart. I don't give two wet farts about your relationship. Charles, can you trace the call? Where is that shit stain? The signal's coming from the Plisetskaya Theater. A theater? Right here in the facility? <laughs> what a clown. It's a theater, comrade major, not a circus. <gasps> Marking the waypoint. Whatever. I won't let that traitor get away from me again. Fading data. Did anything change here with the old testing grounds? I don't think so. Was this one here? Yeah, it was. Yeah, it's all the same testing grounds. that weapon but it's still not up testing grounds might give you blueprints because they have way more loot okay then I'll go to this one right behind me it also has a, a Zazdashka upgrade is it prime Tristorius Where have I gone? Oh, there I am. Make the AK. Oh, I keep forgetting to do that. I've just been mainly... Oh, it was back here? Wait, where's the testing ground here? Is it on the roof? Please stop. It's the elevator door. I am completely fucking stuck. I am so tired of how often this happens. Holy shit. Okay. So how do I do it? That one has three camera openings to open the elevator. So I have to go to one of the towers? Or is it something I do in here? 
Looks like it's just something I do in here. No, it's definitely not. Yeah, it's gonna be one of the towers. Fuck, Jesus Christ. <clears throat> safe to use. So there should be one more. Okay, that's everything, right? You missed one, go back. Go back. Where would I have possibly missed one? That? I just, I hit it twice. forgetting to use my shield. <sighs> Thanks for the resub, Sheeb. This is a long elevator, goddamn. the prime cosma we now have access to the scientific testing ground comrade major you can find valuable weapons in such locations in the future yeah i know your science shit all you do is deceive honest citizens with the concept of a bright future no comment outstanding let's go take a look at the gear that'll help me see tomorrow okay just a big health kit Assuming that's where the training ground starts. I'll make this work just fine. Seismic testing is necessary to evaluate the durability of construction materials as well as buildings themselves during an earthquake. At this site, testing is carried out with the aid of a special vibrating platform that imitates the seismic vibrations of Soviet soil. 
The results will ensure the safety of Soviet citizens within buildings designed by Facility 3826. I'm pretty sure this will work. I don't really trust that, so I'm just gonna try and do it this way. Nice. the first upgrade but I don't have the fucking weapon itself what was downstairs I wonder Give it to me. Damn it. Hydraulic testing is a set of measures designed to test the hydraulic. These both end up going to the same place. Oh, no, they don't. The tests are carried out at various operational stages with simulated conditions. Thanks, You get a lot of loot from this shit. Give me the Zezdashka. Nope. No such luck. There's a point coming down here. God damn it. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it.
there too. That was a surprise. There's a lot of these puppies. I'm stuck on something. I should have grabbed some uh, health from the thing. Do I even have to kill them? I thought I, I thought I would have had to kill them, but it doesn't look like it. Looks like that's just open. the desired procedure. What's this? What do these little things do? You missed loot. Where? What the hell is that? A special transporter for valuable cargo. Or Comrade Lutyagin, according to the employee's facetious name for it. Valuable cargo is all well and good, but why is it stuck there like that? Its base features a prototype of a perpetual motion engine that forces the Ooh, homing bullets for my dominator. I'll do that. Once released, it moves quickly between certain set points. It's dead still. Access granted. That's the one I got, right? Thanks the Prime Canets in the resub Moira. I'm pretty sure this is the one, right? Oh my god, what the fuck?
More blueprints. How did I unlock Electro even though I already had it? That's unlucky. I don't remember how to shoot these, it's been so long. Oh wait, just hold. I remember. Didn't go in. Oh, it's timed. There's the resub fusion. This parkour is the worst. Oh, there's, a par there's a parkour section. Well, I really don't want to go down there. Oh, there's a chest over there, though. Okay, that, uh, that's not what I thought would happen there. Things are some coconut. to go get that chest. Okay, I see there's one of these little things. Too high, I guess. What? That's too high. Yeah, well, that's too high. Sub heavy. <laughs> oh, I want that 
chest. Oh, close. Give me the Zazdashka. You son of a bitch. Is that the only thing this was for? I thought this was just like the right way to go in general. Guess not. Oh, wait. I'm supposed to go back over that way. <laughs> I imagine I need to bring this with me. Oh, and then put it back in that, I see. Damn, there's a high stakes. If I fuck up, I have to do all of that again. Climb these. Can I climb these? These pipes I can't climb. I've never climbed these little metal bars though. You can? I feel like you're just lying to me and I'm gonna fall and die and then have to do all this shit all over again. And I'm gonna scream and cry. Okay, I'll try. Oh, thank god, huge. I don't have a whole lot of confidence in this game's ability to get me over to that. Um, I see there's a pipe here. Am I supposed to go from the pipe? What do I do with this? Do I throw it over there and use it later? Fuck. Go from the pipe since it seems like that's supposed to be the right way. Oh, thank God, huge. Oh, my lord. Had I not made that, I would have absolutely quit the game on the spot. I wouldn't go through all of this tedium again. No shot. Can I just climb straight up here? It's not letting me. Oh no, I, I, now I'm worried. I think I have to make this little jump. I'm assuming I go to these and then to the right. Would be my guess. It's gotta be, that's gotta be it. It should come as no oh. surprise to find access to modern weaponry deep within civilian testing grounds. 
Science and war have always gone hand in hand. Is that what your program God, that would have been think? miserable. Shall we say, that's what I believe. Even the cartoons you're so fond of started out as revolutionary intelligence gathering methods. Lamentable though it may be, war is the engine of progress. I don't know where an AI glove could possibly get beliefs from, but if you ask me, I'm all Baby about Dad. peace. And cartoons. Everything looks like we're done here. Data. How do I get out of the training grounds? Oh, probably this is an elevator. Oof! Thanks, the reset dragon. I'm so tired of these fucking rocks. God, come on.
That did not open this door. So this is just not the right way to go. I oh, never mind. It did open that door. Alright. That's a good stopping point. Alright. Thanks everyone for tuning in. Thanks for the resub spit and okay. New subs, welcome aboard. Sub means a lot. Thanks for subbing. Enjoy the emotes. Have a great rest of your evening, everyone. Thanks again. I will see you all tomorrow. Sleep well, everyone.